Welcome back to all of our Nakama out there. Uh, my name is Burke. I'm Alex. I'm and I'm Kat. And this is going to be our predictions for One Piece Chapter 1067 and beyond. Um, to infinity. Uh, but before we get into that, one more request. If you like this content, please like it, subscribe if you want to see more, tell your friends about it, comment on our videos, help us in that algorithm, and uh, just ring that bell for notifications. Make us feel uh, good. Make us feel really good. Um, but with that out of the way, let's, really get, into, let's get into some predictions for 1067. Uh, 1067. Uh, 10, in one week's time. In one week's time. Okay. Brock, what do you think will happen in 1067? So... Be careful. You might influence my whatever thumbnail I use. I, okay. Probably, probably not in this case. Okay. Because I've got a very... Not, I'm not going to lie, I've got a very boring general thought. One Piece boring? <gasps> no, my thought boring. Oh, your thought boring not on One, one Piece. piece. One Piece uh, isn't boring. Yeah. You know he's just kind of normie sometimes. It's normie. Okay. It's okay. So... Bormy. As it has been for the last forever now... I have no idea where this shit's going. Um, like, detail-wise, mm. it's just... It's hard to tell, because I think as we get closer and closer to the big finish, more and more big things are going to happen more often. Mm. Way more often than they used to. Mm -hmm. Which, by evidence, of what's been like oh, yeah. to date. So, the best I can say right now, I, I think with this huge lore dump, I think we're going to get... Further into the arc, that is, is this island possibly from both Straw Hat groups' perspective? Mm. Maybe a little switch back to either Dragon or since they reference him in a flashback now, sure did. Um, or maybe CP Zero. Mm. Um, I think those are the main possibilities, and yeah, that's that's my thing. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, I think. Well, again, ideally, like, ideally. hopeful wise, I still would really love to cut away and figure out what's going on with Samuel and Vivi, because oh, I love Vivi. Mm -hmm. Um, realistically, I think we're gonna continue the like on the giant lore dump that we just got Huge lore dump. and uh, figure out what Shaka wanted to show Sanji's group. Um, Maybe get a little more from Bonnie Vegapunk interaction mm. there. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna... Maybe even more lore dump. Or mm. more backstory info. More background info. But... Alright. I'm, I'm thinking, realistically, we're gonna kind of stay where we're at for a bit. Loading up the truck with a bunch of lore and going to the dump. The dump it down. Shut up. Alright. <laughs> no, I mean, I, that'd be great. Alex. Me? Yeah. Me! Um, I think this is a perfect instance for a cliffhanger with Sanji's group. Uh, I also think uh, we haven't seen Brook and Zoro in a second, and I want to know what those two hooligans are up to. I forgot they existed for Sanji. As, well, there's now three, three, ladies and gentlemen, Straw Hat groups. Zoro, the Sunny, and Brook, uh, and also this guy. Um, whatever the fuck he's doing Sorry, now. Sorry, I give him a Schmeagle voice. Oh, uh, it's great. Um, Sanji's group finally. with most of the punks, and then now we have Punk Stein and Luffy, Bonnie, and Chopper, and Jinbei. So, literally could jump between those for quite a few chapters. Mm -hmm. I think we need to check up on good old Zoro and Brooke, and perhaps this fuck. Um, <laughs> and, and I think also I'd like to learn, since we've learned so much about the other punks, I want to go between Luffy and um, Punkstein, and then Brooke and Zoro. And maybe, maybe, just hopefully, a little bit of Dragon. And whatever the fuck is happening on Kawabaka Queendom. Cow Kawabaka? Kawabaka? Kawabunga! Kawabunga Kawa Queendom, oh, bro! Maybe, <laughs> but I I'm not I'm not too hopeful for that. I think it's mostly going to be Egghead next chapter. Yeah, that's fair. Yep. Cool. Yep. Yep. Mark. Yep. So, on the same vein as uh, Alex, on one regard here, uh, I would like to check up on Zoro and Brooke. Sword uh, boys. Part of me, and this is just this is a random feeling I get vibe I get. 
think uh, freaking what's number two punk evil? Number two Lilith. Punk Lilith. 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 Lilith has some uh, beef with Zoro after you know he intimidated the shit out of her. <laughs> so I think she's gonna screw with Zoro and Brooke maybe just a little bit. Mm, that's, that's, that my, that's my personal thought. Send more seraphims them. after them. Send uh, Dofi Seraphim after Luffy dude, for fun. Sophie, Dofi Seraphim is gonna be lit. Mm-hmm. Oh, anyway, sorry. So Might be with those fire powers. Such a little child. Kid so much... Dofi versus Luffy. Could be fun. <laughs> no, it's more like. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Um, but uh, my actual big thing that I think is going to happen if we don't have a cliffhanger with Sanji, Robin, and all of them. Mm-hmm. Um, I think what Vegapunk, or rather Shaka, wants to show them might have something to do with ancient weapons. It might have something to do with the technology that Im-sama just used to wipe out Lelucia. It might have some, like, it It just seems like it has some horrifying implications. Let me show you the scariest thing the ancient kingdom developed. Also, it was used very recently. Yeah. Uranus, um, everybody! Could be, yeah. <laughs> or like some manner of speaking mm-hmm. to do with that mm-hmm. also could be a giant telescope and, and i introduce and the flood from halo please god <laughs> anything <laughs> that um but uh he he has a big giant telescope pointed at the moon and San- oh. and sanji looks through it and <laughs> sees anaru and he's like hey i need a light from that guy <laughs> it seems my Lighter is out, <laughs> Anaru. Sorry, me, me, memeing, memeing. Um, I do think that there is a possibility of stuff to do with the moon, but that's just kind of like more crackpotty than yeah. fully. Moon us, Oda, please. <laughs> please don't moon us, Oda. Aren't you like gonna be married? <laughs> moon us, Oda. <laughs> um, and then actually with the Luffy thing, hmm. I actually think. Four groups. Oh I think, no! I think Jimbe and uh, oh, I think Jimbe and Bonnie. We did leave Jimbe alone because I honestly think the blasting off thing's gonna get Luffy separated from uh, from the, the plot. And uh, I, I I think I liked Alex's thought back in our review. I think Vegapunk's a little crazy in his main body, mm-hmm. so random crap's gonna start happening. And it's just going to be total One Piece fun with Luffy and Punk Stein and Chopper. Yeah. And Jinbei is going to have to try and corral that because... It's, it's his job it, now. It's, it's, the adult. it's his job now because he's part of the Straw Hats and he didn't realize what he was getting himself into still. You know, it truly is a wonderful experience to continue to see Jinbei taken aback by mm. what's normal to the Straw Hats. <laughs> It's like, wait, or shouldn't we? Like, no, he's fine. But, but, no, he's fine. Just in most of his interactions with Luffy, it's always been <laughs> about, like, the mission that he's on. And now it's like, now that I'm actually here in the day-to-day... He's like, I'm oh, really thinking of this. Oh, my gosh. I gave my up captain's being a, an idiot. <laughs> I gave up being a captain for this shit. Well, honestly, it's... <laughs> I like, miss Robin. Well, no, what, what, honestly, what it's more like is, like, he's just, like, he seems at peace. He said, I mean, don't get me he wrong. He seems actually so happy to go with the flow. Like, somebody's like, what the hell was that? But most of the time, he's just like, <laughs> what a crazy crew this is. This is so fun. His last yeah. few captains have been kind of rough. Big Mom, Fisher Tiger. You know. I know. This has got to be such a breath of fresh air for It him. is, for sure. Fair, Fisher Tiger was a good dude. No, he was. He was just very serious. But he was under Big Mom for the longest time. And he yeah. also, yeah. And Fisher Tiger also dealt with a completely different One Piece world that he saw a little bit of, again, with um, Usu. Yeah. That, that 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 rampant racism and, and <laughs> hatred for his species. Um, so he beat the <laughs> shit out of that saber tooth tiger to prove a point. Um, if you're a racist, we're gonna kick your ass. Jimbe will for sure. X gonna give it to you. <laughs> <laughs> um, cool. Any any th- any other predictions for ten sixty seven coming in one week's time? I mean, I guess I should notate because I completely forgot about. Notate it. Mm-hmm. I completely forgot about Zoro's group, but I do think it's just as possible to go to their group as well. Mm-hmm. It was like my. It was a general like. I think we're probably gonna stay on this island. You want some straw hat? We're, we're gonna get some straw hat action. Yeah. No, lots of straw hat action. A lot of straw um, hat action. Um, and I'm once again now that we've talked about it, I'm really looking forward to 
Jean Bay experiencing more and more and just laughing more and more because it truly really is wonderful to see every new member just meld into the family that yeah. is the Straw Hats. Yeah. And yeah. just... Do you think after this... Okay, actually, I'm not going to ask it as a question. I'm going to say miscellaneous prediction. Hmm. Eventually, Bonnie is going to join the Grand Fleet. Mm. After this, I think she'll eventually... Bo- like, I think she will join the Grand Fleet. Mm. You know, she doesn't really have a crew. Or anymore. she could be another Straw Hat. Because uh, are we at 10 yet? I'm still tender about Yamato not joining. I see her as... Uh. I see her in a similar boat. I see her in a similar boat. Now this could be, this could be different. Honestly, I'm not gonna. If she's reading out with Kuma, that's a whole nother. I'm not. I'm not going to deny this just yeah. because of, just because her story in particular, in many ways is very is vastly much more intertwined long term with Luffy's than say Trafalgar or Kid. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Seems to be. She's kind of a special standout among the Supernova in regards to the Straw Hat Pirates. Mm-hmm. I would say. Mm-hmm. Uh, Law didn't get to that point until he formed the truce with them. True, true, true. Um, and so I'm not going to say that's not an uh, impossibility. I don't think that's as lively. I think I think all of the supernova are all like super strong willed and really don't want to be under other people. Mm-hmm. I I could imagine it being similar to like Law and Bellamy, where it's like I'm not going to follow your orders, but I'll come help you out. I was gonna I was gonna. Let modify me. since she doesn't have her own crew really that either join Grand Fleet or becomes an ally. Yeah. What's up? Let me ask you this though, Brock. Stop it! <laughs> Let me ask you this though, Brock. Do so. you feel like Bonnie in this arc, Egghead, stop it! Do you feel like Bonnie in this arc is equivalent to Law in Punk Hazard's arc? Equivalent to Law? Yeah. In that after this arc there could be a stop it! There could be like a large um, alliance potentially like was so equivalent do you mean equivalent in terms of status because you know how law at the end of punk has was like hey we're gonna do this big thing together right do you think at the end of this when you know bonnie comes to know the straw hats and understands the straw hats and sees them potentially leading to something that she wants she could form an alliance with them i i also think that that isn't how fast it can i i i don't necessarily think it's a matter of like will she i think it will come to that. Oh, because it seems like her and Luffy vibe very well. Uh, they, they, they. You can eat with Luffy. Like, I still think they're base. siblings. Like, like, you know. and even if they're not siblings, they, they, I could see them being like besties mm. among the the supernova. Mm. And so, I, I think, I think it's one of those things where, given her, um, and I'll let's talk to Sunny Burke. Yeah, no problem. Um, g- given her, um. Gold. seemingly similar foundation to Luffy mm. or like personality to Luffy sure. in some regards. Obviously she's still got more smarts because she knows when to take things seriously. Yeah. Um, For the most part. Yeah. But I think she she would probably get along with her crew faster than Law did because Law is very much the soon uh, soon today mistrusting. Uh, bread. Uh, uh, <laughs> honestly I'm not going to lie. Uh, One of the parts that still cracked me up to this day, and I cannot stop laughing, is when they first, when he gets his first straw hat experience, and they and tie, tie chopper, chopper to his head, head, and he's just like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's just, and they're just laughing at him, and he's just like, he doesn't know what to do, and then finally, it's, it's, yeah, but well, I, I, I'm looking forward to seeing her experience the straw hats, but I think it'll go at a more quick and pace than Laws will, because, you know, they're kind of working together from the get-go, and I think, it was kind of made clear from Sabody that Law and Kid were very much like, don't order me around! And honestly, like, the fact that Bonnie already saved Zoro's ass once on Sabody. Attempt to do. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I mean did, did save did. his life. Just in the sense that, like, yeah, we saved him in Marine Ford. Well, what I, what I mean, attempted to is okay. because it still happened anyway later no, on. No, fair, I mean. fair. Um, I think... You mean? I think Bonnie and Luffy have a mutual 
enemy in Blackbeard. Oh, absolutely. So, this is too. So this, like, just... Blackbeard wrecked her shit. He wrecked her shit, and he was trying to, like, get all... Make her his woman? Weird. Mm-hmm. And then he gave her to fucking off the But, uh, yeah, I think uh, maybe she might get on, like, a, hey, let's take down Blackbeard thing, mm. and she might team up with him for a bit... And it might kind of be like a law thing where like the next few arcs are in service of that because obviously we are heading towards the end mm. soonish. Mm-hmm. Maybe later. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know, Oda. It's okay. I love this story. You need to just keep doing what you're just doing. Just do now. what you're doing. Just but don't um, die before you finish it, please. please. Mm-hmm. Don't get fat like George. Oh. That's all I ask. Oh. Anyway. Again, he's he's done. Anyway. Um, but yeah, no, I think they have a mutual hatred of Blackbeard. Um, at this point, who doesn't? I mean, yeah. yes, <laughs> but but Bonnie special. special Bo- Bonnie has had a recent wrecking within the last two years, obviously. <clears throat> mm-hmm. uh, but same with Luffy by his brother being mm-hmm. killed essentially because of Blackbeard's actions. Oh yeah, and when he hears about the whole law thing, oh my god, assuming law's dead. Whatever that thing, well, even then he attacked him. Assuming law's dead. <laughs> anyway. Sorry, I derailed that one. That's okay. No, but I mean, I would, I would admit, it would really add to it, and, and I, I think it would be really cool for him to to get an actual supernova on board. Oh yeah. You know, I mean, it's like he had his, so many options in Wano, and none of them turned into anything. They I were mean, all too heads. Like strong. to join him. Specifically. Well, I mean, they all have their own things. Like, no, no, I know, I know. Drake I think Bonnie might be able to be that. First Did you one. want Apu to do it? Oh fuck no. Yeah, I can't handle that dude. <laughs> that guy sucks. <laughs> him and, him and Brooke could have awesome jam sessions. No, no, Brooke no, no, Brooke could play his piano. No, no, no. We, no. Apparently, we we love Apu no. as you can see. God, <laughs> I hate no. Apu. And Brooke is the only musician I, for this. I hate now. Apu, yes. and it's funny. It's funny to think of Brooke like sitting there playing on his piano teeth. Check her out. Check it, check it out. Yeah, his dead, his 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 cold dead piano teeth. Yes, that's that the only way playing. I will accept fair. that. That's fair. I can live with that. Oh, right. Right. And those were our predictions for chapter ten sixty seven. Uh, will any of them come true? Wait and find out. We'll find out in a week's time. Run along Maybe. with you. Uh, but yes, go ahead and uh, stick around. Uh, and check out our uh, hopefully some theory video maybe coming from us. Check Otherwise, it out. check it. <laughs> check I hate out you some. All. Check out. Not you, Brock. <laughs> I hate those two. He'll get there. Don't worry. Check check out some of our previous videos if you missed them. Check out some of our future videos if you're just catching up. Yes. We'll see you next time on our next adventure on the high seas of One Piece. Bye. Bye. Dragon for the win. Foxy for the win. Boo. Boo.